to my channel, Cindy Your Reaction. Today we got some more music to react to. Today, you guys, we got Graceland. This is my first time ever reacting to Graceland. Um, Paul Simmons, Graceland. So let's get into a 25th anniversary edition. Let's see how they come in. Let's see what he brings to the table when it comes to music. Let's get straight into it, you guys. Straight to it. Mississippi Delta was shining like a national guitar. I'm following the river down the highway through the cradle of the Civil War. And I'm going to Graceland, to Graceland, from Memphis to Tennessee. And I'm going to Graceland. Poor boys, pilgrims with families, and we are going to Graceland. My childhood companion is nine years old, the child of my first marriage. I've reason to believe we both will be received in Graceland. She comes back to tell me she's gone. As if I didn't know that, as if I didn't know my own bed. As if I'd never noticed when she pressed her hair from her forehead. And she said, Losing love is like a window in your heart. And everybody sees your blown apart. Mm. Everybody feels the wind blow. I'm going to be smooth. Memphis, Tennessee. Families, we are going to Graceland. My traveling companions are ghosts and empty sockets. We're going to ghosts and empty. I've reason to believe we are all here to see the Graceland. There's a girl in New York City. Who calls herself the human trafficker? Sometimes when I'm falling, flying, tumbling, and turmoil, I say, Oh, this is what she means. She means we are bouncing into Graceland. And I see losing love. It's like a window in your heart. And everybody sees your blown. Everybody feels the wind blow. Into Graceland, into Graceland. I'm going to Graceland. For reasons I cannot explain, there's some part of me wants to see Graceland. I may be obliged to defend every love, every ending. Well, maybe there's no obligation now. So Graceland sounds amazing. It sounds beautiful. Like, um, we're basically gonna take a trip to Graceland. I felt like Graceland was nice. It was catchy. 
Um, let's get some fun facts, you guys, because I'm a little bit confused. This is Graceland is a mansion in Memphis, Tennessee. Where Elvis Presley lived, it was where Elvis Presley is buried. And it's now as a museum popular tourist attraction. Paul Simmons called his song Graceland after he came up with a track which reminded him of the sunny record sound where Elvis recorded. Okay, so I did not get Elvis from none of this, you guys. I'm so sorry, but I did not get... I didn't get Elvis from none of this. Maybe the Graceland in, in Tennessee, maybe that part. But more than that, I felt like he was just saying people was traveling. Simmons says the song is an example of how collaboration works even when you're not aware of this title track successful album selling over 15 million copies and winning a Grammy Award of the Year. Album focused on mostly the African music, but it also explores the forms of non-mainstream music. Okay, consider songs to be less African sounding than most of other African based tracks. The singer also won Simon's his third record of the year award. Miss Robinson and Bridge Over Troubled Water. Okay guys, so let me know how you guys feel down in the comments. Guys, I guess this is about traveling, about musicians traveling, about working together and not really knowing that you know you're gonna like something like more musicians that you guys collaborate um, by traveling maybe? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I think I kinda got it though. Kinda, 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 bear with me guys. Um, so this was um, great song you guys by Paul. Let me know how you guys feel about it. Smash the like button if you guys are new. Hit that rail you guys and welcome. Let me know more feedback down below you guys. Bear with me, bear with me. Um, let's go you guys.